Okay, fire time. Okay, you know what? We'll clear all the creeps with a million fireballs. Hello everyone, time to grind here and we are live right now checking out the Ziggurat 2 full launch. Uh, because it officially came out, it officially came out and I'm uh, so excited because I love this game, we've covered it on the channel. Um, and uh, I'm assuming I keep all my upgrades and oh, whoa, what is this? Did they completely change how uh, okay, so I'm still in chapter 2 Upgrade five more skills in this category to unlock the next tier. Okay. They changed how the progression system works. I guess Armory heroes Or do you still level these people up? Do you still level up weapons? I don't know they changed how the progression system works here, which honestly I like okay laboratory So what is this? Increase maximum health of heroes. Um, knowledge gems give more experience. Let's just do one of everything. Increase mastery gain rate. Um, increase mana. Increase mana wand, uh, wand. Damage dealt by all weapons. Increase wand damage. Increase fire damage. Ice damage. Lightning damage. We'll give people more health twice. Oh, so we unlock. This is interesting. I like the way this... So I obviously have a lot because I've played before and I guess like, you know, they reset everything. Um, upon leveling up, earn barrier. Uh, we'll get some more coins. Increase. Um, let's go ahead and get some mana there. Um, I kind of want to just do m m dealt by all weapons. That seems good. Spell damage. Let's just bump up the damage on all these. Bump up the damage on all those. Um, oh, basic damage one. This is interesting. Okay. Do barrier. Health recovery upon leveling up increases. Um, more coins. Okay, so we've used all the progression here. So now we're going to jump into the game here. So what campaign do we want to do here? Desperate measures. So I think we have to do desperate measures. That's the main quest here. Um, it will unlock a new character and a new perk if we get that. So we'll do that. So... We have different heroes that we've unlocked, and they all do different things, but we get bonuses every time by telling you, like, what it wants you to use. So I'm gonna just do the recommended thing of everything so I get an extra mastery bonus, uh, is, uh, is what we're gonna do here. Ooh, we got some cinematics Our now. Our spells have located Jacob, an exiled cultist of the Dark Sect. He's promised to help us if we finish off the sect that humiliated him. Oh. He can't be trusted, but it's worth the risk. Yeah, so the the original Rogue like is would be games like there's an actual game called Rogue. Um, a really, really old game that is like super hardcore, super, it's, it's a very specific game. So just look up a rogue. I think there's a steam version of it now. And that's where the genre rogue like came in. So rogue like is games like that. And then if it has more out of game progression, like this game does, that's when you say it's a rogue light. Otherwise it's a rogue like, but that's, it's a spin on the, uh, the word, uh, rogue. Um, if yeah. Okay. So we have a little fire wand here. Um, this has infinite ammo. And then we have our staff that uses green ammo. Um, and I'm gonna go ahead and uh, be a professional YouTuber here. Also, let me know about the audio, guys. Um, let me know if audio is too loud or too quiet or anything like that. Um, definitely appreciate it. Um, let me see. Okay, that's that's good enough. And then we'll move the chat box up here. We're, uh, we're professional YouTubers, don't you worry about me. Or I guess Twitch streamers. <laughs> Okay, sweet. Okay, let's do this here. So I'm gonna use my wand here by actually was there a chest? No, okay, that's just the spawn room. Okay, so we're going to you. Okay, we gotta defeat all the enemies here. So yeah, we wanna just use this base wand that has infinite ammo to conserve our ammo. Also, oh yeah, we can uh right click and do like a huge fire blast, I think. This is a cool little fire wand. Who else? Who else is here? You here? Also, yeah, how do you guys like the uh, stream starting two hours early? Uh, what is y'all's opinions on that? Because I know I, I kind of want to have a stream that ends up being a little bit earlier. Um, just for people in other time zones. 
but I don't know if, you know, that actually is, uh, you know, helpful or not. Okay, so we cleared this room. We got some experience, got some coins. I like how fast you can run. Very, very nice. Um, oh, we got a, okay, we got the guardian seal. So that allows us to go to the boss fight. That allows us to go to the boss fight here. Um, oh yeah, we have abilities now too, I forgot. Or, I think we've always had abilities, but what is this, guys? He has E, that's a dash. Oh, jeez, what? Oh, these are like freaking sentry guns. Oh, jeez. What is going on with this stream? It keeps skipping. Um, not sure. I just checked mine, and I don't believe it's on my end. Um, let me know if it keeps happening. Okay, what is this? Warcry, recover 5% of your health at the start of each fight. That's a pretty good perk. That's, oh, jeez. These sentries, yeah, those sentries actually are targeting me. Okay, we lost a decent amount of health. Yeah, hopefully the stream stuff uh, fixes. Okay, we got to defeat some enemies here. We'll go ahead and use this one. Actually, let's see what our, what does Q do? I don't know what, oh, that's a speed boost. Okay, so Q is a speed boost. This is like a machine gun kind of one. We leveled up here. Okay. Actually, you know, we're still fine. Yeah, because you can see this is what, this is using up our green ammo. And we still have plenty of green ammo, so. Just want to make sure I'm getting all the experience and stuff. Oh, that's a big guy. But it's only one, so we should be able to. Easy peasy. Okay, so we get to choose a perk because we leveled up. So, uh, improve a perk by two levels, earn one uh, increased damage dealt by 30% when you're below 35 health, or recover, or we could upgrade our war cry. Yeah, recover our health every fight. You know what, that sounds good. That sounds good. I don't wanna have to worry about my health being too low. Okay, what does R do? I don't know what R does. I don't know, I probably should have looked at what my abilities do. But it's nice that I can take some damage without having to worry, because we're gonna, oh, yikes. We're gonna heal in between fights. Obviously, I gotta just, you know, be careful. Oh, spicy, 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 sir. Spicy. Just wanna make sure I get all the experience. I don't remember if the experience uh, disappears. I'm not sure. There we go, leveled up to three. Okay, so our mana is back up to max, I guess. So we'll use this a little bit while we have max of the green mana. Easy peasy. Okay, what do we want our perk to be? After defeating an enemy, siphon cooldown is reduced by 1% or one second. Increase the size of all mana pools. Maximum health decreased in exchange for 25% damage boost. You know what, let's do that. We lost a lot of health, um, but... Okay, let, let's look at what we actually have here. Uh, Falcon Wings, that gives us speed. It also passively lets us um, ignore wounds. Um, also, our hero perk is... You don't have any particularly strong or weak things. What are our... What is it, our... Damage... I don't know... Okay, I don't know what the, the R perk is. Like, I don't know what that does. What does that do? It's not, it's not saying, um, but that's okay, that's okay. We'll, we'll figure it out, we'll figure it out. Okay, so the boss is over there. I don't wanna go to the boss just yet. Um, I wanna go clear all the floors first. I wanna clear, oh, take oath, take an oath to the elder gods. Um, shop price is 25% lower, but shops disappear 20 or drops disappear 20% faster. Or alchemy mana regenerates 40 points over 40 seconds at the beginning of combat. Uh, armor plus 14% incoming elemental damage. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Uh, we don't have an alchemy thing yet because this isn't alchemy, right? This is what type of ammo is this? I don't know what type of ammo this is. Oh, this is spiritual energy, maybe? I don't know. So it, it's okay, this is pretty pretty decent. Hey, Ultra Gamer, how you doing? Um, 
Let's see. Okay, we still have way to go. I'd like to find some other weapons, because if we can find more weapons of, like, all the ammo types, um, then obviously we can, uh, you know... I'm gonna turn my phone on silent. Uh, we can, you know, actually use our things a little bit more. Where are the minions? Oh, they're flying now. Oh, and they leave poison on the ground. Okay, be careful about that. Oh, jeez. Okay, okay, I'm gonna use my wand now. That way I have the mana that I want. I oh, see, I still don't even have full green mana. Kinda wasted that a little bit. Also, is this the only game you are playing? Uh, we played a crab game uh, right before this, and that was pretty fun. Um, but yeah, now we're now we're playing this, uh, and uh, we're gonna be playing this for about like an hour, hour and a half, and then, uh, yeah, that'll be it. We started the stream uh, like two hours early today. Um, to, uh, te you know, try out, see, see some other time zone stuff. Okay. Oh. Aurean Death Machine. Okay, well, obviously we can bring this out here. Go ahead and use our speed boost, I guess. Oh, jeez, there's, like, rocks on the ground. Some buzz saws? What is that? Is that for, can I break that? Oh, he's spawning people. He's spawning people. I'm gonna just still focus on him. Oh, let me get that green ammo. That's green ammo. I think I just keep focusing on him. I think I just keep focusing on him. Oh, yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. Yikes, yikes, yikes. There we go. Let's do this. Let's do this. Also, not a lot of people here. I'm, I'm gonna be honest. You don't you don't go into people's streams telling them they don't have a lot of viewers. That's uh, that's kind of <laughs> not the nicest thing ever. Um, but I'm just chilling. I'm just totally chilling. We had a bunch more viewers when we were playing crab game, but I'm playing this now, uh, and it's gonna be into videos and stuff like that. So I'm chilling. I don't I don't. Sometimes it's nice to have more chill streams. Um, staff mana pool could in be increased. Uh, decrease your mana pools by 10%. Get two more perks. Um, or war cry. Yeah, let's just increase our staff mana. Uh, we got two perks. I guess we leveled up twice. Uh, wand mana regeneration. Get a new amulet after using siphon. Let's just, yeah, wand mana regeneration increased by 15%. Let's just get our mana regeneration up a lot. Um, that seems to be good. Let's go to the next floor here. Hey, Hemo, how you doing? We are, we're, we're trying to do good here in Ziggurat 2 here. And we're getting to, we just got to the second floor here. I'm excited. I think we got a pretty, I, the biggest thing is we want, I, I'd like to find more weapons here. I'd like to find more weapons because... As of right now, we only have the wand with infinite ammo, and then we have our staff for the green ammo. What are you gonna get me here? Oh, we freaking got a gun! An energy blaster. Oh, it's like a shotgun. And I can, okay, sweet. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay, so now we have uh, multiple ammo types. We have the, we have the staff, um, and we got the gun. So that's, that's nice, that's nice, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. So now I can actually use these a little bit more. You know, obviously. Oh, that that thing said it's a healer. Okay, let's try to kill the healer then here. Oh, jeez. Okay, pulling out the shotgun. Oh, that shotgun's good. Dude, this shotgun's insane. The shotgun is insane. Um, okay, so we need a key to go in there, uh, which we do not have. Yeah, the good thing about using this mana regeneration thing is, uh... Oh yeah, I think one of the perks is giving us the mana regen on the gun weapons here. So we can just use this shotgun, like, a lot. Holy cow, that's good. Okay, let me go make sure I get all the... Man, all the experience. So that was just a dead end. Nothing in here. I love that you can run so fast. It's so nice. 
Just get through the map. Okay, defeat all the enemies. That's easy peasy when we have this freaking shotgun. Where are they at? Are they, oh geez, they're like flying in the air. We leveled up. Oh geez, oh my gosh. Oh. Yeah, this shotgun is insane. Oh, we gotta keep these. Two enemies left, one over here. Dude, this shotgun is insane. Okay. Uh, maximum health increased. Um, yeah, let's just do that, just in case. Um, okay, so we had a, what, was that a key fragment? Is that what it said it was? Oh, we need three pieces. Oh, so we only have one, so what does it say is behind here? You need a master key to open up this lock. The key is divided in pieces hidden in the dungeon. Find them all in order to complete the key and open the door. Ooh. Ooh, okay, okay. Oh, we got a key piece. Okay, we got two key pieces. We got the guardian seal. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Those are spikes. That was a trap. Okay, well, I want to get this key, though. I want to build up the full key before we go to the boss. Oh, actually, we're... Okay, well, we'll use some of this now, this ammo here. Because we've been using that shotgun. Shotgun ammo's been going down a little bit. Oh snap, I'm taking damage, but I mean, we have so much health, we're regenerating health at the beginning. I feel like we have a pretty solid build going on right now. Um, okay, key piece wasn't back here. It's probably gonna be over here. That's my guess. Oh, okay, this is just one of those turret rooms. Open up the chest, what we get? Okay, so we have a different staff here. Uh, this thing's doing way more damage. It's slow, cross-shaped uh, shot, and it's lightning damage, and it may stun enemies. Oh, okay, okay. I mean, definitely the uh, the better the better staff. Okay, stop shooting me, sentries. Stop shooting me. I don't appreciate that very much. Um, we're still missing the. Uh, Where's, where could the other key piece be? Is it in here? Is that what's showing on the map? Oh, it is right there. Okay, oh, yikes. Okay, we took some damage. We got the master key though, so we can go see what, what is in this uh, special room here. What's in here? What's in here? Upgrade the weapon. Um, which weapon? Probably our level four, right? That would be more impactful. Divine weapon forged by the fire. So what is it? Is it a... Dude, it's a level five weapon now. Okay, this staff is uh, easily the uh, strongest thing that we have. So we're gonna uh, go get ready to fight the boss here. Uh, this is going to uh, do some massive damage here. Oh geez, oh geez, oh geez. Okay. We don't have a lot of health. We do regenerate some of it, though. <laughs> Reziel the Bone Rogue. Okay, okay. Oh, we do a lot of damage. Just gotta keep moving, because he's obviously summoning something behind us, or under us. Oh my, we do so much damage here. Okay, this thing penetrates through in case we need that. Oh my, he's just summoning bones constantly underneath us. Oh my gosh. We're about to run out of- Oh, jeez! Ah! Oh no, we're, we're getting low actually. Okay, okay, shotgun time. Shotgun time.
Come on, come on. There we go. We did it. Oh. Oh, man. This reminds me of a combat-oriented version of Phantom of the Abyss. Oh, I could see that. I could totally see that, actually. Especially with, like, the theme of, like, going through temples and stuff like that. 100% agree with you there. 100%. Okay, what perk do we want? Recover 15% of our health. Um, uh, after you switch weapons, uh, you switch weapons 20% faster. Now let's just get more, recover more of our health. That seems like really good. Okay, we're on to the next floor here. That that boss fight got f close though. That boss fight got close. Okay, we're on uh, floor three here. Still would like to find, um, I hope that we get the, uh, weapon of the first ammo type. Because we still don't have a weapon of that type. So I would, I would, I would appreciate that. Oh, we got it! We got it! It's a spell? It's a fire spell. Okay. So now we have, we can shoot fire. Oh, just shoot a million of those. Okay, sweet. So now we have all three ammo types. We'll very rarely have to use the, um, very rarely going to have to use the, um, our base wand with infinite ammo. Especially with all the mana regeneration perks that we took. Oh my gosh, get away from me. Get away from me. Oh geez. Well, I, I probably should have looked at what level this spell is. Also, I'm sure certain types are good at, against certain enemies and stuff. I just don't know the answer to that. Okay. Bringing out this... Oh, this, this wand is insane. Two enemies left here. Let's use a shotgun, because I think that's what we have the most abundant uh, ammo uh, for... Okay, that was pretty, pretty good, pretty good. Okay, I'm gonna run around with the shotgun here. Ooh. Get out of here. Oh, these things explode when they die. Those things explode. And I wanna make sure I keep getting the mana that they drop. Nice, we leveled up to level eight. Dude, this shotgun is so satisfying. I'm just trying to make sure that I always use whatever I have the most ammo for. Or mana, whatever we're going to call it. Nice. Okay. Um. Oh, recover 10% of the mana at the start of the fight, or maximum, oh, it's just maximum health increase. I mean, as we saw from that boss fight, I think we're gonna have to brute force our way through a, oh, geez, just caught myself on fire. That's okay, though. That's okay. These are ice guys. Does that mean fire is good or bad against them? I don't actually know. I don't know how things work here. It seems to be effective. Oh geez, exploding guides. Your last last two here. The combat in this game is so satisfying though. Really is. Okay, got all the mana there. Okay. I think you def oh, okay. We got the guardian seal, so we can go fight the boss now. Obviously, we want to clear out every single, uh, every room, though. Just, if anything, not only for a chance to get more weapons, but, like, mainly just to level up, right? Oh, it's a lot of these explodey guys. Mainly just to, uh, get the extra perks or skills or whatever. This shotgun is amazing. Also, I don't even think we've found a shop yet. We still have four, oh, 45 coins, but the, I know that used to be part of the out of game progression. I don't remember if it is still. Because obviously it seems like they changed the out of game progression. 
Oh, as we finally get to a shop here. Get two random perks. Um, minus 5% damage, minus 20% mana usage. Potion. Okay, we'll just get this middle one. Two random perks. We increased our movement speed by 5% and recover mana from experience crystals. Um, I don't want to lose damage though, but mana usage, actually, we'll take that. Okay, let's go ahead and reroll the shop. Oh, it doesn't. Okay. Um, it's technically a better staff than what we have. Uh, I'm not going to waste my money on that, though. This game looks fun. It, it definitely is. It's it's one of those, like, if you're a fan of, um, you know, the fast-paced first-person shooter roguelites, like, um, uh, like um, Immortal Redneck, or there's actually an original Ziggurat. Oh, we have to destroy obelisks here. Okay, okay, so it's not just killing people. We have to destroy obelisks. There, okay, there's the first one. Okay, destroyed the first one. So they're gonna keep spawning until we kill all the obelisks. Where are the obelisks? Obelisks. Ah, there's the second one. So I think we kind of just tunnel vision on these, obviously. There we go, there we go. But yeah, I, I haven't played a uh, first-person roguelite in a while, and they're 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 a blast to play. I, I normally prefer like you know other types of roguelites, but um, I don't know. These are so much fun to play sometimes. And and this one is a little bit more streamlined. Like it's less about like making like crazy quirky combos. Um, I mean like you know we have a build going, but it's it's more sort of streamlined. Which can be a good or a bad thing. I think it's hurts it in terms of its replayability a little bit, but I think it um, helps it in just being able to pick up the game and having a blast. Um, after defeating an enemy, siphon cooldowns reduced by one percent. Okay, we'll get that. I think we haven't been using siphon our ability here. Um, it's not really telling us what that siphon is. I think that that maybe sucks in all the projectiles being shot at us or something like that. Um, okay, so we've gone through everything, so it's boss time here. And we're going to obviously be using our OP staff here at the beginning. Okay, we'll have full health here. We have a shield as well. Ooh. Citra the Immortal. Okay, here we go. Gonna be faster here. Okay, let me siphon. I don't know what that does. Oh, oh, you're teleporting. You're teleporting, are you? See, maybe I should kill the things that it's spawning, but I feel like tunnel visioning on the boss and just doing an obnoxious amount of damage is is a good play. Okay, fire time. Okay, you know what? We'll clear all the creeps with a million fireballs. Okay, siphon. Still don't really know what that means. Oh, we're, what? Okay, siphon. Siphon. Or not siphon. Whatever this is. Just shoot a million fireballs. Kill all the creeps. Let's actually control them. Dude, th this fireball thing is amazing. Oh, it does give me mana. You're totally right. You're totally right. Thank you for, uh... Yeah, 100% right. Okay, shotgun time. Shotgun time. Oh, my gosh. Keeps teleporting. Or she keeps teleporting. There we go. Let's go. Yeah, okay, so knowing that it gives me mana now, it's pretty good. Okay. Um, increase your fire rate. Decrease your mana pools. Okay, yeah, increase the fire rate. That seems good. That seems good. So let's see. Did we get all the experience and stuff like that? I think we did. Okay, sweet. I think there's, what, one more floor? That was floor three of four. So we have one more floor here. Got one more floor. The final floor.
Okay, we got this. We got this. I don't even know what I'm really looking for here. Uh, that's litter. <laughs> what? Okay, this is this has got the same problem that Void Tyrant has. You you can't you can't offer me the exact same thing I have. That's that's disappointing. Okay. Find all the magic shards. Okay, there's there's one. We have to find 17 magic shards. Okay. Where's the magic shards? There's one. There's another. Three out of 17. They are not going to uh, stop spawning, I don't think, until we get all the magic shards. So it's best to, I think, just tunnel vision. It's pretty hard. Any more down here? 10 out of 17. There's a lot of new stuff. Like, this entire room type wasn't here in early access. Okay, I think we got to go up now. Oh, there was one in that corner. One in that corner. Oh, there was one down there. Okay. Uh, 15. 16. There's one more here. One more. Oh, jeez. There we go. There we go. Sweet. Okay, we did it. Now we just gotta clear these. There's six enemies we gotta clear. Actually, not that much. Okay, this shotgun is starting to uh, not be the best. I mean, obviously, it's like, you know, not the uh, strongest. It's only like, what, a level two or level one or something? Oh, we got knocked down here. One enemy left. Let's get out of here. Okay. The word siphon makes me think there has to be something like enemies or projectiles near, but I don't know. Maybe it's just kind of a reload. Yeah, maybe maybe they're because you're right. The siphon does kind of mean that. After defeating an enemy, siphon cooldowns reduced. A random mana pool will increase its capacity by 20% and lower mana usage by. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay, it's our staff. Nice, I like that. Our staff is the uh, the best one we have, so I'm okay with that. What is this? Oh, that's yeah. Okay, let's 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 try this staff here. Okay, well, yeah, let's try. I'm gonna siphon. Okay, yeah, there was there was no one near me, and I don't think I regained anything. So I will now next time I will try using it uh, near a bunch of enemies because I think you're you're I think you're onto something. I think you're onto something here. Definitely think you're onto something. Oh, I got a key piece. Oh, is there a secret uh, key room here? Okay, definitely gonna try to find those then. What was that? Shooting like rocket launchers at me? Actually, here, here. Let's let's go ahead and run right up next to him. I don't know. I don't know what that did there. Maybe there's got to be a lot of enemies or something. Okay, so we have one of three key pieces. Drink from this fountain to recover all your health and increase its capacity. We'll go ahead and save that. Yeah, because it almost gave you all your mana back when you used it during the boss fight. Yeah. Uh-huh. I'm 99% sure you are 110% right. I think you are you are very right here. Oh geez, okay turrets. I just gotta check everywhere just in case of a key piece. Necromancy enemies are res oh all enemies respawn once. Holy cow! That's that's okay okay fireball time fireball. Actually R. Okay I gained some back. Oh that is so many. Oh my gosh. Okay. Do the million fireball things. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me get right in here. Okay, there we go. Yeah, see, I'm siphoning more, more of the mana there. Yeah, I think you're definitely onto it. Okay, okay. Um. Okay, yeah. I gotta, I gotta like train these like zombies in Call of Duty. The good thing is, is we're pretty much like always at full health. 
Um, because we gain 15% of our health at the beginning of every fight. Like, that's... It's kind of good. Oh my gosh, them respawning. Okay, okay. I think we just have these guys left. Oh yeah, that thing shoots through all enemies. How are there so many? I mean, I, I know why, because they respawn, but... Okay, I want to go make sure I get that mana, or that experience. It's a lot of experience. Oh my gosh. Okay, one enemy left here. We're gonna siphon right next to him. Oh, yikes. Sweet. I got an achievement called Rules Have Changed. Win a fight with an active modifier. Oh, okay. I've been getting a lot of achievements, so I haven't been calling them out because I'm pretty sure they're just achievements I already had gotten, but... Oh. Is that a trap? It seems like a trap or something. Okay, we're going to bring out the shotgun. Oh, jeez. That's the exploding one. Nice, nice. That guy's golden. Well, oh, he's a healer? Yeah, don't heal the other ones. That's not nice. I don't know how he was healing people. He was shooting me with a crossbow. Okay, so there's there's the lock that we're going to need the three key pieces to. Obviously want to try getting into that. I'm going to get some lunch. Yeah, no problem. Thanks for, thanks for tuning in and stuff like that. Always nice having you, like always. Hope you get some Yama food in your system. Okay, do shielding. Do I just gotta... Okay, we're gonna bring this... Oh! I'd lurk if you had the command, but I don't think you do. What is the lurk command? I don't even know what that, uh what that command is. I am I am a I'm a new person to uh to all the Twitch culture and things, so I, I genuinely don't know what that is. Um each mana crystal you pick up give me barrier. Just increase the fire rate, honestly. So this is the boss. I don't want to go in that though. I kinda wanna get the key pieces. Okay, where, where are my key pieces at here? Oh, yikes. Okay, Guardian Sail. Is there a key piece anywhere over here? No? Um, is this a challenge room? Before you open this chest, you'll need to defeat several waves of enemies. Um, you know what? I don't think, I feel like I'm powerful enough as it is right now. We have full health against the boss. I just want the secret room. Just want the, uh, the secret. Oh, here's a shop. Um, recover full health. Well, oh, that's a level, s I don't need a one though. Just in case this is still for somehow out of game progression stuff. Just in case this is for out of game progression stuff. Okay, here we go. Here's a normal, normal room here. Okay, I've wasted so much ammo. Holy cow. Oh, geez. Okay. A lot of these things, so I'm gonna have to do some trains. Oh, that's satisfying. Okay, let me go get all the mana here. Or all the experience. Oh my gosh. That is so satisfying chaining like lining him up like that. Okay. Give me give me my shotgun now. And shotguns are what I need against these ghosts. Oh man, I need a better shotgun though. 
Okay, you know what we're doing? Okay, first of all, siphon. Just fire everywhere! Fire everywhere! The flying enemies are always the more difficult ones. Cause you gotta like aim vertically, you know? Challenges you to aim a little bit higher than you normally would. Yeah, Siphon doesn't do anything when there's only like one person. Okay, um, still can't find this key. I'm gonna go through all the rooms though. I'm gonna do it. I want that, whatever it is. What is that? It's like an angler fish. Yeah, healing 15% of our health at the start of everything is pretty nice. Pretty nice. Oh, jeez. Oh wait, I need to be saving this mana. Okay. Where where are these key pieces, man? I'm I'm tripping out. Cause they're Okay, we're we we got to find the key pieces here. We gotta find the key pieces here. So this is the Okay, we'll drink that now. Increased a it no, okay, I thought that was the key piece. I was like, no way. Where are these key pieces at? So I guess it actually hides them pretty well. Apparently. Oh, we took... Oh, that was stupid of us. We took a lot of damage there. Can I just not find them? If I can't find them, I uh, might just go fight the boss fight. Is that a button? Looks like it might have been a button. Um, okay, you know what? Screw it. Who, need, who needs that? Who needs that one? You could just go fight bot. Ah, no, I need ammo, though. I do need ammo. I got, like, no ammo. I mean, we have the siphon, but... Okay, this is where the actual key was. I know when I played in early access, there were like some actual like parkour challenges to get some keys and stuff, but I don't, I don't know. Okay. Uh, we're going to go ahead and reroll the shop. I don't need a better wand. Like, I mean, it'd be nice for a better wand, but I don't think we're going to use the wand at all. Oh, I keep, I'm taking so much damage like a dumb dummy. Just like speed, speeding fat, way too fast. Okay, key piece, anywhere? Where art thou my key piece? Huh, yeah, I don't know. We might just have to do a hard boss fight here. That might just be the way it is. Oh, there's a key piece. Okay, we found one. We found one key piece. See, yeah, they're, they're just hidden. I did hear a sound, though. There, there was, like, an audio, a, an audio, whatever the term is. I don't know. There was, like, an audio cue, though. Ah, oh my gosh. I've taken so much damage just from those traps alone. Just from those traps alone. Okay, okay. We got this. We can find it. We can find it. We can find it. Wait, it's literally just right there. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the shop and heal up. Um, even though I think we're gonna heal. Oh, I. 
Oh, we can only reroll once. Okay, well, I kind of ruined that, didn't I? Okay, well, in that case, let me go ahead and actually buy a good wand. His wands have infinite ammo in case we somehow... Because I kind of... Oh! Kind of wasted my ammo, so... Okay, we just go down this way. You guys ready? I'm, I'm, I'm ready here. I'm ready to beat the game. But first, we must unlock the door. The secret door. Ooh, upgrade our weapon. Um, uh, let's just upgrade this thing again. Wait, wasn't it already at six? Is level six the max? Because if so, that's lame. Because we, we look pretty hard. Maybe I should have upgraded something else, but whatever. Okay, we're going to heal 15% of our health. Let's do this. Let's do this. <laughs> Ursula the Sinister. Coming straight from uh, the Little Mermaid. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. As soon as she summons people, though, I should be able to do the siphon. Oh, yikes, yikes, yikes. Okay, siphon. Nope, that didn't give me anything. We already got her to half health. Okay, she's shielded. Oh, yikes. Okay. Oh my gosh. What is happening? Oh my gosh. I don't even, I don't even, oh my gosh. What is happening? Oh, those things are protecting her. Siphon. Okay, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, my wand, wand, give me my wand. Oh geez, we're at 50, we're at 50. 50 health. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh! <gasps> can we do it, can we do it, can we do it, can we do it? Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Oh, that actually kind of got close. That kind of got close. I can choose a perk. I don't think it matters, though. Because I'm pretty sure that's that's the end, right? Dude, my heart is racing. Oh. My heart be racing. We freaking did it. Got two achievements there. For a worshipper of the dark gods, Jacob is a man with a great sense of honor. A deal is a deal. I'll help you in your quest. But when this is over, we'll be enemies Oh, is again. that the new character we unlocked? For now, his skills and dark knowledge will prove useful. Ooh. So we had defeated 431 enemies, cleared 24 rooms, 45% accuracy. We unlocked Jacob. A zealous worshiper of the dark gods, Jacob joined the Brotherhood after a pact of honor, or maybe he's just plotting to infiltrate the Order to betray them later. Moreover, Jacob enjoys upsetting his new colleagues. Although unable to control magic weaponry with ease, his dark packs and sacrifices confirm huge power boosts that make up for it. Oh. We also unlocked a new perk, uh, Cleansing. We unlocked Faster Learner. We got eight insights. Okay, okay. So these are all of the things that, that they earned me the insight here. So now we can use it here. Um, let's see. The um, health recovery upon leveling up. Upon leveling up, get the barrier. Um, let's do more knowledge. And increased maximum. Okay, let's get all the. Okay, this is all the mana. Mana is good. Um, and let's increase all the damage one. Increase basic damage. Okay, there we go. There we go. So that's that's the progression here. So now we're in chapter three, War in the North. So you can always do these little like um, 
I guess you have to do two side quests and they tell you, so like this unlocks a brand new alchemy weapon, this unlocks a brand new wand weapon, there's constantly new stuff to uh, unlock. I mean, I have like four hours in this game, not a ton, but you know, we have a lot of stuff unlocked and we still have a lot more, so what are the characters? I wanna look at the new character we unlocked, Jacob. So they all have active skills, so his, okay, his is Siphon, instantly attract all, oh, instantly attracts all items in a range dropped by enemies. That's what Siphon did, okay. Like, hers is repels and damages nearby enemies. Um, also, as you level them up with the mastery, um, they get passive and special effects. Um, so he, spend 5% of your health and get higher damage and fire rate with no mana usage. Oh. And uh, she is, hides your presence. She kind of goes stealth or whatever like that. So uh, that's interesting. So I think this is a pretty good stopping point. I just wanted to, you know, do one, one run of Ziggurat 2 and kind of... Uh, see how it stacks up, you know, now that it is officially launched. Pretty, pretty freaking cool. Um, and, uh, yeah, so if you're also watching this as a VOD, when I release the video as a VOD, I'll be giving away one copy of the game on my Discord server, so, you know, stay tuned for that. I'm assuming most people are watching are already in my Discord, but if you're not, you know, check that out. Uh, and if you're watching this after the fact, you know, appreciate it and stay tuned for more content.